Preston and Steve. On 93.3 WMMR. All right, let me switch over to the uh, remote mic here. <clears throat> Excuse me. And uh, we're going to head out into... Uh, the green room, because I believe we're going to do a kind of a uh, physics experiment. Why will Joe not get hurt? If you're going to take a sledgehammer and smash a cinder block over his body. His well, nuts, specifically. Right. If all goes well, the energy from the, cinder, from the uh, sledgehammer is actually going to go into breaking the cinder block rather than driving it through his pelvis. And if all doesn't go well, will he be then spitting I his nuts take out? Take absolutely no responsibility. Oh, okay. All right. We'll do that first. We're going to put a, uh, a plate over the area. And uh, now just your standard cinder block. I mean... One you'd get at a local dime store. That's right. That's right. Is Buddy going to do the swing? All right. Whenever you're ready, we'll, we'll give a three, two, one, and then fire away. Okay. When you're ready, here we go. Ready? Yep. Three, two, one. Oh! Joe, that's pretty oh, wild. I'm tough. Yeah. I'm tough. <laughs> we have more uh, fire experiments, I think. I love fire. And, no. and also, apparently, it'll make a really loud boom. I'm going to go over here and talk to Steve, who's in charge of, uh, of things from uh, the Franklin Institute. And All Steve, right. you've just tied a, uh, a balloon to uh, a roll of duct tape to keep it anchored here to the ground, string leading up the, the balloon's about six feet up. What is inside that balloon? That balloon is filled with a little bit of oxygen and a whole lot of hydrogen gas. It's just a standard size party balloon. Yep. Yeah. Not, yep. not a gigantic balloon that that, uh, that they brought in specially made or anything like that. Casey is... Uh, he left. <laughs> Casey's about 50 yards away. He's plugging his ears. He's got, he's got the chicken stick lit. He's now heading out to the balloon. Here we go. Let's see what happens. All right. Hold on. Oh, oh Jesus! Whoa. The science! <laughs> oh, the science! <laughs> that was pretty wild. Did you feel the shock? Yes, I did. Crap. There was like a shock so wave. Awesome. Holy crap! Scared the bejesus off and thumped me in the chest. <laughs> wow, that was sweet. Yeah, bigger balloon. We have another one. And uh, is this the same thing? Uh, I believe this is just hydrogen. This is just, just hydrogen. hydrogen? It keeps blowing away from it. Oh, oh, what the science? <laughs> science! Why the hell did they ever get in templates with that crap in it? <laughs> Steve, what, what causes the colors? The colors, we've got salts, special oh, uh, chemical salts. And the salts burn different colors when they go up. <laughs> Yellow on the bottom, yes. orange in the middle, and then we have uh, purple at supper every time. All right, closer with the chicken stick. Here we go. Oh! Oh! Yes! Holy oh, crap! Multiple yeah! balloons of science! <laughs> Did you feel the heat yeah! of it? Totally, man. Oh, my Jesus God. Christ. That was awesome. I couldn't I see. Love that. Did you catch the colors? Of no, I didn't see the colors. I, I saw yellow. Yeah, I saw, I saw a lot yellow. Of yellow. Oh, that was sweet, man. I'm glad I was over there. That <laughs> was pretty but, damn uh, sweet. Well, uh, the first two times I was a real big puss, and I put my fingers totally in my ears, but on the last one, I kind of just cut my ears a little oh, bit. Oh, uh, but it was coming around. It was awesome. <laughs> All right, well, there you go. That we, we, we've done it. Our, yeah! Our All big right! Come on! Yeah! We've got to go back inside. Chris, what do, what do we have next? What are we going to do here? Uh, we have a couple of exciting things with some liquid nitrogen. Okay. Um, the story on liquid nitrogen is it's very, very cold. It's about 320 degrees below zero. Wow. That almost yeah. looks that almost looks uh, uh, interesting to eat there. Well, it is. We are going to eat this, Steve. This is uh, uh, Steve has brought this in. And uh, Chris, what's in there? So we do have some, basically, your ingredients for ice cream, except for the cold right now. There's All right. heavy cream. There's some vanilla, some sugar. Oh. Okay. And this is a gigantic bowl that they've brought in here. This and is Rosie O'Donnell O'Donnell cereal. <laughs> <laughs> it's huge. It's awesome. So yeah. we're going to add the liquid nitrogen to this. That will be the cold. And in about 20 seconds, we'll have some tasty ice cream. Oh, are you no, serious? It, it happens yeah. that quick. All right, Joe, pour away, and let's get some... How much? Uh, Watch their hands. Yeah, how much Start is it? You, you tell yeah, them when to stop. Them. All right, now it's going in. We have loads of, of steam or gas, whatever this happens Whoa. to be. Is this gas, I assume? This or? is gaseous nitrogen now. So yes. as soon as it hits the warmth of the air, it goes from a liquid back to its gas. Okay. Now, we know this is siren nerve gas, correct? <laughs> <laughs> I, can't, I can't even see the bowl. Yeah. Gas. Yeah. We can't even see the bowl. And how do you know when you're out of it? This gas is cold, man. It's, I, I, I can, can see the liquid it. pour. I can yeah. feel the... Uh, and the gas it, goes down because it's cold. That's how you can tell it's not... Steam. As it spills over. All right, now, oh, Joe has the... Uh, uh, oh, the doer, which is the contender. Now, you're spilling some of that, Joe. Be careful. No, that though. wasn't him. All right, you're done. It's empty. All right, and <laughs> they are mixing it up as we speak. I can see it. Is it, is it forming into ice yeah, cream? Yeah, at the it's, bottom it's, of the bowl. The right side's it. tingling. All right, can I try some? We're going to try whatever you uh, say. Where are the spoons? Wait, okay. really? You just yeah. They mix it up, and sure enough, yeah, like 30 seconds later, we've... Uh, there be ice cream! Yeah! Yeah! Captain, Science! there be ice cream. <laughs>
All right, I'm going to try a little bit. Let's I'm, transport some ice cream back to Earth. And it's solid, man. It's good. Here, okay, here solid. we go. As a rock. Oh, my God, that is really good. I want some. Wow. Okay. Give me some now. <laughs> go. We got, here, Steve, spoon. I'll get you some. Just give me the whole Hand me a spoon. No, Thank that's you, okay. Preston. In case you can have that. Laura's jumping right in and helping herself. Hey. Go right to it. Not bad. Thank you. Thank you, man. I'm not kidding. That stuff's really, really good. Ooh. Wow. And it's there's like a community bowl. That is good. <laughs> there's nothing um, noxious about this at all. Uh, no. Not until it gets into your stomach and it expands. <laughs> what? And you, and you exp no. <laughs> there's nothing wrong. With it. Do we have um, one more thing we'll do, or now we're, we're going to detonate the ice cream? What do you think? <laughs> well, <laughs> we're not going to detonate the ice cream. We do have. Um, a typical, ordinary, everyday racquetball. Okay. Ah. Um, which has been uh, so close cool. to the stellar, exciting Taking a bath in the liquid nitrogen one. for about an hour now. All right. So the normal one bounces right. nicely. Bounces, yeah. yep, that's the regular one. Here's the other one. Oh! Oh! Smash it! Slash it! Slash it! Slash it! I think we also have some Cheetos for Nick to eat here. It's Nick Zilla. <laughs> <laughs> Can you do this through your nose? Yeah. Yeah. It is coming out your nose, Nick. Not as good as out of your mouth, though, man. All right, oh. d eat another one, and this time, just eat, mouth. Eat with your mouth. Eat like Rosie with your mouth open. There you go. Drop mm. it like it's hot. <laughs> Delicious. Well, there you oh, go, friends. Another awesome. exciting science day Woo! for the Preston and Steve show. Are you done? Yeah. Yep. That is it. Ray John, have a great weekend, everybody. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Preston and Steve on 93.3 WMMR.